Hello, I'm going to deploy shared VPC using Terraform. In this uh, Google Cloud Console, I have three projects. The first project is going to be my host project my, and the remaining two project is going to be my service project. These two service project will be attached to the host project. I also, I have also provisioned a VPC one, uh, which is already created with the name VPC one, wherein I have two subnets. The first subnet is in New Delhi region. The second sub subnet is in US central region. So I'm going to import these uh, uh, VPC subnets and VPC in my Terraform code. Now let's look at my Terraform code. Uh, on the left hand side, you are seeing some .tf files. These .tf files are the HashiCorp configuration language. So this is basically my Terraform code. Let's start with the variables. In the variables, I have already declared my host project. And uh, this is my host project and uh, service project one, service project two. In the provider, I uh, since this is going to be target on my Google Cloud. So in the provider, I, uh, I set the Google Cloud and my credential file. This is the main code. Uh, to start, we are going to enable a shared VPC in the host project. And here we are attaching the service project one to the host project and we are attaching the service project two to the host project. Uh, remember that we have uh, a VPC one and uh, two networks already created in the Google Cloud Console. So we are using the data block to fetch our VPC one and their two subnets. Now here uh, I'm creating a VMs in the in the shared, shared VPC project and the subnets uh, that uh, this VM is going to be allocated from the host project because my shared VPC is, is going to be hosted in the host project. So this is going to be my first uh, VM with the name my demo VM one in the service project one in my first subnet. This is going to be my first subnet and my second VM uh, will be created in service project two in second project and this the name is going to be my demo VM two and uh, uh, the subnet is going to be subnet two. So let's quickly run this code. The first command that you will uh, do is terraform init. The second command will be terraform validate. It's fine. Let's quickly apply this. So this is going to add my five resource. Zero to change, zero to destroy. So we are adding five new resource. Just confirm with yes. And now it has started creating the resource. The first thing, it, the Terraform is creating your um, shared VPC in the host project. And now it is attaching your service project one and service project two to the host project. <clears throat> and the next thing it is going to deploy the compute instance. So it's still creating. All right, so you can see that all my five resources are completed and this is my host project. Now quickly go to your Google Cloud Console just to validate your resources are completed. So if you look at the shared VPC, you can see that your shared VPC has been created in the host project and this is your host project. And uh, in the attached project, you will see all of your uh, your two service, uh, service project. And uh, here you can see, sorry, here you can see your uh, shared subnets. So you can see, just filter it and you can see your subnets, subnets one and subnet two are shared um, uh, with the service project. And if you go to your service project, this is my first service project. Uh, this is my second service project. You can see my demo two. If you go to my first service project, you'll see uh, this uh, VM instance, uh, which is uh, deployed in uh, Asia South 2A region and the network is VPC1. This VPC1 is coming from my host project, shared VPC, not from this project, right? Similarly, my, v, uh, my demo VM2 is also hosted in the service project 2, which is in um, this project 49030. Again, here the VPC1 network is coming from the shared VPC. So this is how uh, shared VPC works. Thank you.